Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Great Conqueror Rome. In today's episode of Great Conqueror Rome, we're gonna have a look at a new conquest which was unlocked last night. I just unlocked it last night because I uh, finished the gameplay uh, in the Funic War. So we're gonna have the Caesar time. So in Caesar time, we have so many stuff to look at. We have Rome Caesar, we have uh, Nomindia Kingdom, we have the Rome Pompey, we also got the Lusitani, we also got the... Uh, Canterbury's, we also got the Volke, also Aldi, Alveni, uh, Namnestes, also Brighton, Nervi, uh, Sugambri, also got Subio, we also got Helviti, Mastilla, uh, Noricum, Storisic, also Boy, we got Boy, we also got Darcia Kingdom, we also got Orisian Kingdom, Rome, Crassus, we also got the uh, Bithynia Kingdom, uh, Solosid Empire, uh, Pontus Kingdom as well, and Egypt and Rome crosses. So let's have a look at boy, my boy right here. So it's a hard one. Uh, if you win, you get three thousand five hundred and thirty-five medal. That's a cheap ass one. Let's see what do we have over here. Oh, we joined the war. Okay, okay. So boy, boy is kind of a tribe thing, you know. Looks legit. Uh, auxiliary, uh, light infantry, swordsman, that's all they have. Um, yeah, that's all they have, I guess. Uh, some sort of a uh, new uh, stuff that we always looking forward to. And there's some also a uh, light cavalry right here, which is very good. And Roma, ooh, these are our allies, okay. So we're going to have uh, Florentia. Madame Nim also a new type of a flag, if I might say, because back then we had the, uh, we have the, uh, I remember the eagle flag, but now we have only the, uh, the leaf flag thing, you know. Uh, looks really nice, by the way. We also got Aquila. So this, this, these three people kind of ally, you know, at at Spain, and this one here at Carthage, and this guy here at uh, Greece and kind of look cool because we can also see who's our enemy okay so our enemies are Volke, Namasmones, uh, Bosporan Kingdom, Arwani, Namazistes, Nervi, Brighton, Sirisi, Subio, Jesse Kingdom and many other more so there's a lot, there's a lot of looking forward, even Egypt is on our side, so playing as boy, it's pretty much easy, if I might say, if you look at the, oh shit, if you, if you have, have a look at the friends and foe, looks like uh, you have a lot of enemy, and it's gonna be bullshit since you're the one that sits in the middle of the fight, and you can end up getting yourself screwed by the enemy, and for those who, I think starting point at uh, Rome crosses at Greece is way much easier. You just go right to the enemy, and you can also deal with the Solacid Empire. And looks like Ernestus Mones is going to be a big fight for you. Okay, so, uh, pretty much a good one. And I would, I, I want, I want to say that the map is pretty much accurate by now. I mean, yeah, it's hella big, and we still have a few more maps to come. We're gonna have Asia. Um, and many other more. It's gonna be a really, really long fight. Trust me. It's gonna be really, really long. Last time I played the Punic War, it took quite a while. And can you imagine playing this right now? Ignore the voice, the backgrounds, and some kid screaming. I don't know what the freak is wrong with this kid. Anyway, uh, oh, we have this guy here. Still, I think Rome should have had these, and at Palma would have been nice. Uh, would have been a challenge playing as boy. But uh, I, w I would like to tell you guys something, for those who own an iPad and have the game, there's an event in EFC community where you have a challenge event. The first challenge is that you have to finish your campaign uh, when you reach the Gallic Wars. And for the second event is that you have to play as this conquest in Caesar time as Nessa Namontes try to win the battle. And win the conquest yeah I don't know how they do that but it's just a challenge and pretty much uh, go back to our thing uh, pretty much the map is now accurate but still imagine if this World War 2 damn it's gonna be a really big fight yeah somebody if somebody mod this into World War 2 
God know what's gonna happen. Trust me, Craig. Yeah, gonna be really big. Anyway, uh, pretty much accurate by now. The map is really good. Uh, just take quite a long time to reach, but as long as you upgrade your uh, tech in your Senate, everything's gonna be fine. Uh, thing gonna work really well. And uh, yeah, that's it. Hope you guys enjoy this and leave a like if you do. And it's already 1st of July, I don't know what EasyTech is doing, maybe, maybe they're trying to fuck with Android user, who knows. But <laughs> but uh, I, I know the pain, it just keep on waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting and still no answer from EasyTech. Well, uh, I will try my best to inform if uh, I have news from the APK. Yeah, then, and then yeah, thank you guys so much and I will see you guys next time.